What's going on YouTube? Living Proof Fitness. I know that I've already answered this question in a previous video. However, there are still new subscribers, new people stopping by the channel all the time. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go over this real quick again. Because as you guys very well know, this channel is the blueprint for you skinny dudes trying to put on weight, trying to put on some muscle, trying to make you some gains. Tired of being a little skinny shit, then you made it to the right channel. So. That being said, shouts out to Tyler. I believe that's your name. He actually had uh, got at me on his uh, Instagram account. Sent me a fucking DM or whatever the hell you call those things. I do have, let me see on the screen right here. Down here, in this area down here, are the little, little watermarks for, uh, you know what I'm saying, our social media. So if you try to write me on YouTube, try to write my boy Fredo on YouTube, can't seem to get a hold of us through there for whatever reason. I usually, I always respond on YouTube. But if for whatever reason you wanted to hit us up on a social media, you can hit us up down here in these links down here. Anyways, this dude, Tyler, wanted to know how exactly he should come about gaining some weight. It says that he is 5'11 and weighs 132 pounds. So yes, this dude is definitely on the skinny side. But all hope is not lost, my brother. What you need to do is put yourself at a caloric surplus. A caloric surplus is a state in which you eat more calories than your body can burn. So, for example, if you eat 3,000 calories per day and you burn 2,500 calories per day, that means that you are at an excess amount of 500 calories. That being said, when you create a caloric surplus, your body takes that extra energy and either uses it to build muscle or uses it to store fat. Either way, it's putting on weight. Now, 3,000 calories was just an example, and actually I gave that to Mr. Tyler. Not exactly sure how many calories he's consuming. He did not actually give me that information, but he did say that he thinks it's somewhere around 3,000. But people do tend to have a problem counting the calories when they're just eyeballing the food. So what you wanna do instead of eyeballing the food and just judging it that way, you wanna actually track every single calorie, all your macros. Just in the beginning, at least until you start getting used to it. Put yourself at this caloric surplus. So if he thought that he was at 3,000, he goes to start counting up his calories and he starts to realize, you know what, I wasn't at 3,000 calories, I was really at 2,000 or 2,500 or whatever. Now he knows that he needs to bump his calories up. So what you do is just find your calorie mark of however much calories you need to be at to start gaining weight. In his case, I told him to start at 3,000. See if you start gaining weight. Hop on the scale, check to see exactly what you weigh, right? Start your little diet of excess calories, putting yourself in a caloric surplus. After one week, hop back on the scale. See where you're at. Did you gain any weight? You didn't gain any weight? Go ahead and bump it up by 200 calories. Do it again for another week. And eventually, by using this method, you are going to find a mark where you start to put on some weight. I would not recommend that anybody goes overboard and start trying to gain three, four, fucking five pounds a week or some crazy shit because in reality, you are not putting on muscle. Motherfuckers that say that shit are either liars or they're on the juice. You are putting on a shit ton of fat if you're doing it like that. I would say aim for about a half pound to about two pounds per week max. No more than two pounds per week. You, not, you gotta make sure that you stay in the gym as you're doing this, so that way all those excess calories are being utilized to build muscle instead of just sitting around, playing video games, intaking all this extra food, and then getting fucking fat. Because anything that's worse than somebody who's way overweight is somebody who's skinny and takes off their shirt and just looks all fucking flabby. Skinny fat is not attractive and you'll pull zero bitches. If you need help tracking all your calories and your macros, make sure that you get online. There's a free app called MyFitnessPal. Download that app, absolutely free, and it's pretty badass. You can literally track every macro, every calorie for your day. If whatever product that you're trying to eat has a barcode, it has a little barcode scanner. You take it, scan the shit, 
all the fucking nutritional information will pop up and it makes it that much fucking easier. So you know what I'm saying? There are tools out there. We got apps, we got Living Proof Fitness, we got shit that's gonna get you some motherfucking gains, put on some fucking weight, put on some muscle, and get exactly to where you wanna be at. So no more excuses. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, become Living Proof. <sighs> Good shit, I'm making gains, bruh. Are you?